Hi and welcome back to eBuyer. Today we're unboxing NVIDIA's GeForce RTX 4060 Ti graphics card and I'm so excited to get into it, so let's just get into it. But obviously I'm a big fan of the box art, um, very clean on the front. Just have these specifications on the back of it as well as say, telling you on the front exactly what's in it. So for example, the exclusive DLSS3, which we'll get into in a bit, ray tracing and all of that. On the back, it just tell you exactly what the specifications are and stuff like that, which I'm a big fan of on NVIDIA's boxes. So let's just get into it. out system. Leave this box right there. Nice. Nice. Minimal packaging. Pull this little bit out. Obviously you have your registry notices and your quick installation guide there. So I'll put them to the side. Get the main part out. So this is the 8GB VRAM version that we have here today. Uh, this comes out today, so you can get this in the description below at ebuy.com. And it does have a 16GB version and a non-TI version coming out later in July. So keep your eye out for that. Put that in there. Straight away, nice sleek, low profile design. Obviously it's got your RGBs there to kind of liven up the inside of your PC. You've got your 8-pin connector there for your power supply. Obviously got your display ports around here. I think we've got three display ports and one HDMI port. It's quite a good selection there. This is pushed as a 1080p graphics card, but obviously it can run more 1440p uh, games and select titles at a push. So the AD Lovelace architecture was quite, uh, it's usually at the heart of most expensive and you know powerful graphics cards. So for example, the RTX uh, 4090 um, has the AD Lovelace, but now you can get it on more budget cards like this one. And with the uh, DLSS3 uh, exclusivity that AD Lovelace brings, it's obviously a lot faster in your ray tracing, your AI um, kind of powered graphics and your carefree gameplay and stuff like that. Um, so which is really good on a 60 class um, graphics card and about four of the five best graphics cards in the world are all 60 class cards. So it's again, amazing for the value that it is in it. And I mean, it just, it also just looks great. I'm loving the uh, GeForce RTX and the nice MSI logo as well as the, on the logo on the fans too. Um, like I said, this is a 1080p uh, graphics card, but according to uh, NVIDIA's gaming performance figures, this is about 1.15 times faster than the 3060. So overall, it's again, an amazing little graphics card. I just noticed the MSI little plastic plug in there, which I'm a big fan of. The 8GB version is rated at 160 uh, watts of TGP, so obviously, quite on the lower end. And if um, you do push your um, games to those 1440p and you wanna get the most out of this graphics card, it will get a little bit hotter, but obviously I'm pretty sure I can handle it. So like I said, this has a 16th, uh, 16 gigabyte version coming out in later in July, but both of them are kind of identical on paper. They both have over 4,000 CUDA cores, so they're both kind of in that mid-range level. They both have 128 uh, Tensor cores. They both have 34 RT cores, which are ray tracing cores. Um, and they both have 32 uh, megabytes of L2 RAM. So again, they're both quite amazing little budget graphics cards, but obviously your 16 gigabytes just has a little bit extra VRAM. Thank you for watching today's video of me unboxing the uh, new NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4060 Ti graphics card. You can get yours down below in the description over at ebuyer.com, so please check that out and we'll see you in the next one.